first extraction this year. It's a bit late in the year, but the weather, you know, permit it. back after using the repellent. Is this the last frame we're taking out? Yeah. Just taking the supers? Uh, well, yeah, but we use uh, hive bodies, full hive bodies for deep hive bodies mm -hmm. instead of supers. Sure. Okay. some problems in the lightest one there's only one side we'll manage Should I drive up to the garage? Oh, uh, yeah. Here's your... Oh, okay. The extraction... Oh, okay. Yeah. We'll start with <coughs> capping. You need that Tupperware? Uh, yeah. Cappings, people forget about them, but they are great for colds, and it's a old doctor from Vermont that recommends them. Have to chew them like chewing gum. Okay. So you just save the cappings for use, for personal use? Yep. Okay. You can strain them and, well, actually, after you chew them, you can melt them or keep chewing them till they break apart, basically, if you keep uh, chewing them. And you can uh, swallow them, no problem. I'm not sure how many... I was know that E901 is one of the E's used in food industry. It's the one that tomatoes, apples, or other fruits and vegetables are covered with, with mm. beeswax in the supermarket. Oh, sure. Mm -hmm. You can see the honey right through the sun through it. Uh, yep, yep, yep. This is black locust, and with all the rain, it will be like water. Okay, so after we get the first frame, we set it up in the extractor. We need another free to go with it.
frames in the extractor close it and at first you have to go slow because it being full of honey it's a lot of stress on the comb and it might ruin the, the frames you can see how it starts dripping on the walls This is the first round speed. For about how long do you do this, George? Well, that's it. We have to go till it uh, empties. We get the frames empty. And it will take a while till it will show up on the spout. Here's the spout, we have it screened before it goes into the food grade mm -hmm. bucket.